Hello everyone, Moose Torrent here, and today we have Flynn's Furious Fist build. This thing is actually pretty good. I was surprised how much damage we're doing with this. It is a Hestus. It is along the quality infusion, so we have the skilled version, and it gets a C in strength and dexterity. We have 45 of both. That plus the Flynn's Ring gives us 388 attack power, and this weapon can be buffed. We might buff it with some fire because that makes total sense. You have some straps of leather, set it on fire, and it will hold up perfectly and not hurt your hands at all. Keep that in mind if you guys ever need to um, use a flaming punch attack in real life. Our armor here is a little bit heavier than the standard Flynn setup. I'm doing that because since the fist only weighs 0.5, we do get a little extra points to defense. But obviously you could go naked or rags if you want a little more attack power. So we have Ragged Mask, Grave Warden Robe, Cornix Wrap, and Cleric Trousers. And the Ring of Favor, Flynn's Ring, Life Ring, and Chlorinthy Ring. Let's get started with the PvP. Our opponent has the Cell Sword Twin Blades. That poised weapon art is so useful. He poised through his weapon art with it even. So good. Well, Yorm's Great Machete may do quite a lot of damage through our Poise Stance Weapon Art, but I think it's worth a shot. We did 775 there. And the Poise strikes again. Let's see if we can poise through a hammer smash from Smog. I know he actually has a poise weapon art as well. What is going on? Let's do battle on the battlement. This isn't really a battlement, I don't think. That would have been such an epic way to finish the match. Are you trying to run back up there? Come back here, you! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Dang it, he cat ringed me. Our opponent is invisible. Oh god! <laughs> this came out of nowhere. Oh yeah, we got him good. He was not expecting the poise power of the man fist. Oh, he hit me with his man stick. <laughs> Both we punched his man stick into the ground. GG. A deep bow from our opponent. Looks like he has the Grand Lance. We'll have a grand old time with the Grand Lance. Oh, he broke our poise. Did not expect that. Oh, <laughs> we were just out of reach. Good game. Looks like our opponent has the Karthus Rouge Crow Talon. The Karthus Claw is a deadly weapon. You gotta be careful when you're fighting that thing. You also have to be careful when you're fighting the fist. Our opponent has the Karthus Claw. And some Pyromancy. Oh, is that Iron Flesh? I don't want to mess with that stuff. Probably a good candidate for the um, Iron Flesh. 
because it has those quick roll attacks. That nice weapon art. Punch him in the sack, <laughs> but he still killed us. Looks like our opponent has the Karthus Rouged Warden Twin Blades. We've got the Flaming Flint's Fist, so I think it's an even match. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We got him good. We fisted him. Our opponent has the Irithel Straight Sword. Now he has the Murakumo. Now he has the Irithel Straight Sword. Will he switch again? No one knows. has an odd fighting style. See, I always should roll because I see on the screen that I'm way out of range, but those attacks just they hit you unless you roll. Yeah, I really do not think that works anymore. Wow, we hung on by a thread 28 HP. We did it. Our opponent has the war pick. Wow, 990 damage combo. Good game. Oh no. Our opponent has the Medikiri OP Dachi. And he's got that Karthus Rouge. We got the flaming fin fist and we punched him in the face. Oh, our opponent has got the lightning. What is the exile curve grade sword? We've got the flaming, flaming flin fist of furious flame. Oh god. That. Oh, oh god. Oh god. We're. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Looks like our opponent has homing soul mass and crystal magic weapon on a scythe. He's not falling for our poise weapon art. Well, maybe he is. Wow. <laughs> we punched the crap out of that dude. Our opponent has Gunder's Halberd. Oh, I was expecting that. No! Oh, he got us. Good game. Opponent has a curved greatsword. Looks like the Karthus curved greatsword. Missed my R2. Wow, he got the parry on my second strike there. Oh, he punched him in the knee. How about that? Our opponent has the Dragon Slayer Sword Spear. Well, minus the sword part. I just get so used to saying that. That's actually the build we want to see the least of. Because it has those... Quick attacks, plus the long range, you can really snipe us and keep us from getting our combos off. Now he's pulling out a bow and arrow. I don't know why I had to poise block that. Traded hits with his arrow. He's doing some damage here. May rethink the bow and arrow strategy. Punched him right in the gut. If I were him, I would have stuck with the spear. Kind of like that. 
Normally I would not appreciate that, but since he's using the <laughs> Crescent Moon Sword, I just I just can't get mad at him. Six hundred and fifteen damage, man. <laughs> These fists are good. Eh. Oh, our opponent's buffing up. We're buffing up. Flaming Fist. Oh, I thought I saw some poise there. No such luck. Oh, he's running away. Looks like the Partisan. That's a really cool spear. I wanted to try that out, but I still have not gotten to it. A close one. Ooh, he gets us in the end. What are you doing? Looks like he has the Drake Blood Greatsword. Oh, I thought I hit L2. 788 off those two L1s. Then 416 for the win. Our opponent is purple. And as you know, I love punching purple people. Right in the... <laughs> I, can't, I can't even say it. Now I'm laughing and getting stabbed by a spear. <laughs> oh boy. I've been trying to do that old massive fist combo, and it has not been working for me. I wonder if they patched that out of existence. Ooh. That's what happens when I make childish jokes. Actually, I can't even make it, because I start laughing halfway through. Oh god! Get him! Oh, almost punched him in the butt. That was my chance right there. And I blew it. Oh, he's still alive. This is a extremely close match. Ending in a draw, that's how close it is. This is Moose Torrent, and I'll be back with another video for you guys shortly.